I don't know what you think about Law and Order, but uh, this story is called Law and Order Fanfic. It's a script by Where Did Angels Go? Uh, it is tagged Fiction, Fanfic, Oral, Penetration, and Hot. Ooh. Ooh. Playing the part of Elliot Stabler will be Boots Rain here. Playing the part of Olivia will be Come Quads Up. Yeah! And I will be playing the part of Olivia in the future, reflecting back on her life and, and narrating events because uh, writing is hard. Yep. Right. Just so you know, mo apparently most of what I'm saying is an aside, so <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, you don't understand it. Elliot, you're up first. Okay. Liv, just let me walk you home this day was hell. It was true. He had just tried to convict a killer who cut off people's hands and used the bones to make a chandelier. <laughs> it took us weeks to catch this guy. By then, he had killed and cut off hands of 18 victims. Not to mention, he had a killing spree. No. Not to mention, he had had a killing spree by the bones age about 10 years ago, but was never quote because he was running around the country. Lucky for us, he was messy this time. Not to mention, he tried to make me one of his big tomes. <laughs> Fine. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, you know, after me, Kathy, separated, you've been really helping me get on my feet. <laughs> Don't meet on it, backslash. <laughs> I stared into those wonderful eyes. Eyes that I had seen every day for the past, oh, how many years? I've lost count. His lips full, slickly cracked from the cold of winter, but looked so kissable. Halfway to my house! I couldn't help it. I grabbed his hand. Oliver? <laughs> Sorry, just cold is all. I was... I was lying. He looked so hot after a day of work with me. His rough hands and strong arms. I was fancy. Oh God! I was fancy. I was fancy. Something, something in that general area. About him, the rest of the way to my apartment. When suddenly he looked right at me and tucked a simple stand strand of hair behind my ear like friends do. But I lost it. I grabbed him by the tie and I yanked him close. I crushed his lips onto mine in a warm, past yo net kiss. Back it out! Olivia, what the heck? Where's the walking? <laughs> Show, don't tell! I, 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 I don't know what to say. Come <laughs> <laughs> on, oh, Me and Kathy have only been separated for two weeks. I know. I just, after all that has happened these past few weeks, I needed comfort. Would it be in app riot to invite you upstairs? Just to hang out, I need someone to talk to. Well, okay. Following <laughs> is stage directions which our actors will perform. <laughs> <laughs> we ended up talking for hours and it finished off about half a Jack Daniels when I went to kiss him again, only this time he didn't push away. He grabbed my close and I put my arms around his side neck and he slid up, oh I wish I was looking at this, and he slid up my my hair. We kissed so hot and soon our brief I was heavy, almost panting. I was so turned on. He lifed me up on the couch and lay on the bed and soon was on top of me. <laughs> but, 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 I quickly flipped him so I was on the bed. Only I flipped him the wrong way and he soon fell off the bed. <laughs> we 
burst into laughter. <laughs> but get up going. He ripped open my blouse and kissed my neck. I took off his tie. I took off his tie and ooh buttoned his shirt at lightning speed. Soon I felt his. Soon I felt. You're Olivia. You're stable. <laughs> Oh, there, there's the word member. Soon I felt his members seeing, seeing, seeing. I felt it against my leg. He put me on the edge of the bed and swinged me back. I could see his huge erection through his pants. He undid his pants, but his pants didn't drop. I yanked him forward, and he was kissing me at Jane. He undid my bra, and, oh, God. Oh, God, I, I felt his hand. Go down my pants. As soon as fingers were inside me, I went out and home. As, as he had not one, not two, but three inside me. You little whore! Is it Tootsie Roll Pop? Oh, Elliot. I said, also, I was almost soaking through my panties. I was so wet. He then drops his pants and boxes, and I yank my pants and under where off, ready for him to be inside me. Not yet, he said with a devilish grin as he pulled me further up on the bed. I was under him, completely at his mercy. He kissed in between my thighs and so close to my clit where his chow went for only a bite second. Say my name. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Do me. <laughs> how? Tell me how you want it. He see I ain't facing, still between my legs, as I could feel his hot breath. I want you all. Of you, I want it all. <laughs> as you wish. He went down at me as town, playing with my clit where his finger was, why there's no more action, just sliding in and out, and I could feel myself coming already. And then I did. I screamed out. And out. Just it. He put his hand above my head and he cuffed them to the headboard. Then he was inside me. I first slow, but then picked up the reatum. Oh no, he picked Pick up the Pick it up. Go faster, harder. I said, and he did. The bed was rocking, and he was all the way inside me, pounding me harder and harder until I came like again. again. Shut the fuck up. I was shocked. He could shut the fuck up. He could last so long. But before he came, he pulled out. Oh, no. oh, oh. What's wrong, El? Suck me. <laughs> and I did. <laughs> Skip the rest of it. Oh. Oh, it's me. Oh. Oh. He came, as he came in my mouth, I swallowed it, and he went back to kissing my neck. I woke up the next day, still cuffed to the headboard, but happier than I had been in mouths. Comment if you want this to be contained. I don't mind critics. Sorry for my spelling, by the way. It's my first time writing erotic, so I'm new at this. End of story. Yeah.